Mr. Ebu was uh, laid to rest yesterday. He may so continue to rest in paradise. He was laid to rest and uh, he was buried in his house inside a room that was uh, newly built. He was buried inside so that he can be really, really close to, close to his family even after, even in death, he can be close to the family. And of course, uh, Mr. Ebu is a national treasure. What he has done and everything he has he has done for all of us, majority of us, not all of us though, for keeping us smiling in our hard time, you know, for entertaining us and so many other stuff. May so continue to rest in peace. And I hope God overlooks his shortcomings and uh, every other thing. So there is something I want to discuss mainly about Mr. Ibu, about one of his daughter who claimed she has never met her father before the only time she met mr ebu was in the hospital the last time and he died she has never experienced any fatherly love from mr ebu ha it matter shocked me never experienced any fatherly love from mr ebu <laughs> Well, before we go there, let us uh, dash a little bit. Let's talk about uh, Portable and uh, Very Dark Man. This is what Portable said about Very Dark Man. Portable said, Obi Kubana made him a billionaire. Remember that time in Portable come aside, he signed a deal, a record deal. No, no, not sign a deal. Sorry, he signed an endorsement. This uh, beaters for one particular beater, he signed an endorsement for that beaters, and he was paid like fifty million naira for that endorsement. Yeah, from uh, portable. Well, uh, Portable is the last person may get right to condemn very dark man because he himself is irresponsible. There is, there's, if there's someone that I will not take that issue of condemning very dark man is from Portable. Portable is not in the right. If you say, say, but I say, drink or there. Although he's not saying the, he's not saying lies. So after all, Obi Kubada uh, made him a millionaire, gave him fifty million naira. So at that time, we were thinking if Portable can. Be a brand ambassador. Obi Kubada made him a brand ambassador, gave him 50 million naira, and he said to so 2 million naira every month. 2 million naira every month. And after that, he got a lot of other endorsement as well. This guy, Portable, is not the right person to criticize very dark man. He himself is very unloyal. It's about gain to him. It's about money, 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 money. We, the reason why I'm, I'm not happy with very dark man, it's not even about money. I think this is beyond money. Forget money. It's beyond money. Understand? But that being said, of course, now, no say David Doe don't pick now. David Doe choose Polo, choose the, to the head not, choose Obi Kubana, and choose uh, Iaba Ojo over very dark man. Because Polo posted a video and uh, David Doe immediately collaborated with that video. That is indeed everything Polo said was fact. Polo was the first person to 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 made him his 10 million naira at that time. 
his first 10 million naira in a big now big money as at that time polo was the first person you know give respect to who respect is due give respect to who respect is due so the guy tried for the music entertainment industry hmm? big man <laughs> polo well that being said, like I've said before, portable no be pessimist, so pull pull my out for the matter at all. A portable no pull my out for very dark man matter. Hmm? But very dark man, hmm, I don't know. He will check if he post. Well, he has gained whatever he needed to gain 1.5 million followers. And I think people still talk about him a lot. And he's going to stay assist a lot of people and keep doing what he does best. By calling out those uh, rubbish stuff, but if not they say an activist, now activist now no like him. Now freedom fighter, no, now they are attached to his name now no like. Is it content creator who assists people, who speak about uh, irregularities in the country, just like so many other content creators out there, who speak about women not behaving well, who talked about government not behaving well, who also do some certain investigation, and who also do give away for their own people or outside person there are so many people doing that but now picking him as above every other person nah i don't uh, now that one i know now that one i know what but very dark man is he, 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 he's he's very dark man to whoever who placed him at that place you know he's a very nice guy though a good guy that for that eh? Now they hype him up. Hmm? Apart from that, he messed up though. Let us say the truth. Hmm? The truth has set us all free. Now, now coming back to Mr. Ebu. One woman said Mr. Ebu is a father. That she never experienced fatherly love from Mr. Ebu. Listen. Can you please tell us your name? Full name. Okay, oh, you are Mr. Ibu's daughter? Yes. Okay. Um, briefly, can you share with us um, your relationship with your dad? Uh, when yeah. was that? Okay. I was alive? I'm his first daughter. Okay. So we, we had a lot of you know, moments together, but I didn't get to meet him in person until he was sick. When I got to the hospital. That was the first and the last time we got to see each other. So that's the only thing I can tell you about him. Um, First time and the last time you saw him? Yeah. Okay, uh, the moment you saw Oh, wow. So, the first time you saw him, uh, how do you feel? I mean, meeting him for the first time. Meeting him for the first time and on a sick bed, which was so frustrating. So it's not something I, I love talking about. I just have to accept everything that you have seen. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, so sorry about the love. So sorry about the love. So now that it's no more, what, I mean, uh, what do you think is going to be? I mean, your your feelings about his demise. Well, I'm not happy that you didn't get to know him. You didn't get to show that father and daughter relationship very well. But I'm sure wherever he is now, he'll be happy that I'm here to support today's occasion. Mm. Uh, so sorry about that. Okay. So, yeah, I love Mr. Ebo and may so rest in peace. But we cannot deny the fact that Mr. Ebo did not fix his life before death ha ha the last time a daughter your first daughter had a moment with you was in the sick bed and you walked by ha somebody said one of mr abel's major problem was having numerous affairs with women which led to many children of which he had little or no direct impact on. It was his weak part. May we learn as men from these mistakes that can destroy a man. Ha! Gay, no enjoy fatherly love. How do you want this girl now to cope? Jesus is an adult. Live past it. You are a grown woman now. 
This kind of girl go swear for papa, I go meet her for where a day. Ha! Ah, if, oh God. Oh. Someone said, let's say the truth. This man was reckless with women and gave birth to a lot of children. I know a boy in Satellite Town, CBN Estate, too, and I never saw his picture. And I never saw his picture as his son, but I knew he was his son. Another person they talk about another boy, make his suspect say be Mr. Abel's son. <laughs> that means Mr. Abel get a lot of children. This guy couldn't come bring his children together. Oh, this guy, did Mr. Abel go here out for half. Okay, God forbid. But if you look at the way of life, you can easily tell, say, hey, God, oh, well, okay, let me know, just go there. May his soul rest in peace. May his soul rest in peace. Amen.